Welcome back everybody. In today's video I have crazy news because PayPal Tommy from Mass Accountability has decided to represent himself in his trial. Now he's on trial for a very serious offense. He basically assaulted an older man, a disabled man that is. He pushed him and he was beating on him allegedly. So it's a very, very serious case. But he decided to represent himself because, you know, he's a YouTube lawyer, right? Why hire a real lawyer when you know everything about the law because you watch YouTube videos? And as you guys will see, he's already doing crucial mistakes that even a basic attorney would be able to overcome in matters of seconds. He's really making a fool out of himself and the judge is recommending that he should hire a lawyer. Anyways, without further ado, let's enjoy the video. Um, can we so can my stuff be returned to me? So they're, he's going to confirm that they are done with the search on your uh, personal property. And if it's done, then we'll get that return to you. Um, we can give you a short date to come in. Um, and I'd ask the Commonwealth, could you make arrangements for the property to come here if, in fact, it can be returned? Yes, Your Honor. Okay. Um, and again, the medical records are in the clerk's office. You can get a copy of the search warrant in the clerk's office. And then the one thing that's outstanding is whatever um, they bought from the phone from the search warrant. They don't have that yet, so you still need to be provided that. Yes, I, I would love that because okay. that, that's part of my evidence as well. Okay, so, yep. Um, um, is there a day of the week that's better for you to come back into court? No, I, as, as soon as possible. If, okay. if this is going to be just to try to get my... Uh, to get your property and, back and for me the to video. Rule, rule on the motion. Okay. Yeah, and if, um, if... I would also like to put in for that uh, the booking footage as well. I, I've, yet, video? I've yet to get any of that okay. as well. So here he is trying to retrieve videos before the trial actually starts. So it's part of discovery. It all makes sense. But it turns out that PayPal Tommy did a request with the court. He filed it, but not being a lawyer, he didn't know how to file it. And he filed it the wrong way. And he's about to get reprimanded for that. All right. Which I did put a, um, a preservation of evidence on. Okay. Um, Attorney Yago, did you know if you requested a booking video? No, Your Honor, and I just had development in the case. Uh, Your Honor, the if I apologize to the court, Your Honor, the motion that the court had noticed today was not timely filed. Um, I apologize. I should not have answered on that case. I wasn't aware of the current procedural posture. Um, no, there's not. And the search warrant was executed, but we don't have a video in the return just yet. Your Honor, this is what I've been running into this whole entire time. I, I have not been able to represent myself correctly. As the Constitution of States, I should be able to. It, I'm getting a little frustrated five months and I have nothing. I and they've had my property seized. Okay, so part of the issue, um, I, you're not a lawyer, right? Correct. Okay, so the motion that you filed um, is actually incorrectly filed. You filed it under the rules of civil procedure, and this is a criminal case. Um, and I know you, you just didn't know that, um, so that's why oftentimes it's helpful um, if you have an attorney I represent that. you. And I'm more than happy to either appoint an attorney to represent you or if you would like to have an attorney work with you as standby counsel, um, I could do that as well. It may help move the case forward um, a little more quickly for you. I'd still like to exercise my right to represent myself. Okay, that's fine. So obviously the judge realizes that this clown has no idea what he's doing and he's way out of his depth. And then she offers him an olive branch and says, hey, why don't you just get an attorney, a public defender, or you can even have an attorney as a counsel and still represent himself. But of course, PayPal Tommy thinks he's smarter than everybody else, so he will represent himself, and just like Direct D and all the other idiots before him, he will lose. That's fine. Um, so um, can we just take a short 
date? Absolutely, Your Honor. Um, so we're gonna on the on the next date, we're gonna determine whether or not your property can be returned to you. If the Commonwealth um, is done with the search of the phone, I would ask that it be returned on the next date. Certainly. Um, we're going to call the clerk's office, let them know that we're going to get you a copy of the search warrant, and we're going to get you a copy of the medical records. Okay. Um, you now have the 911 call, and the Commonwealth is going to request any, any of the material um, that was retrieved as a result of the search warrant, and they're also going to request the booking video. So on the next date, you hopefully should have all of the discovery, and then we can move on to the next stage. And I will also take this motion under advisement. I understand the Commonwealth's position on it. Um, Thank you. And um, I'll rule on it by the next date. All right. And can I put in a motion for more evidence since we're going to have another date as well? So they're going to provide all the remaining discovery for that next date. Well, I, I believe now that we've moved along that there's even more evidence from them I need to gather. And is it something specific? Yeah, there's, there's a good, good amount. Can you can you tell me what it is? Well, uh, some I, I would like to get uh, any files or documentation that they they have gathered on me over the last three and a half years, uh, Salem PD and uh, the DA's office, because I do have emails of them talking about three years ago trying to trump me up on charges for what I do. So now PayPal Tommy is overstepping as usual. He's asking for everything that Salem PD has on him, three years of public records, and that's nonsense. Obviously, that's not going to happen. Okay. Um, and also emails between the chief, um, the mayor, uh, talking about my arrest and the alleged victim in this case, that they redacted that email as well. Well, I, I don't find that any prior emails would be relevant to this particular case, but if there is something with respect to this particular there is on that alleged too, yeah. victim, um, I'd ask the Commonwealth to look into that. In terms of communications, if I understand what Mr. Matthews any, asking for. Any communications um, about this particular uh, Mr. Herbert? I will certainly make inquiry. Any, okay. any emails between the chief or any... About this gentleman. About this, me and this gentleman, yeah. I will make inquiry of that. If I could, Your Honor, just reserve if the court would be, um, I understand the court has indicated that it is aware of our argument in terms of the motion. May the Commonwealth reserve its right just to supplement anything in writing if we need to. Sure. Thank you. Okay. And is, did you say any day of the week is okay for you yeah. to come back? All right. Um, let's see. 18th. Two weeks enough time? I think that's plenty of time. February 1st? Sure. Is that okay? Yes. Yeah, All right. So February 1st at 9 o'clock. Thank you, Your Honor. You're welcome. Appreciate it. Thank you. I, I can just go right to the clerks and get that? Yep. It might take them a few minutes yeah. to get it, but yeah, right. you can go there now. Yep. So that's the only appearance of PayPal Tommy in the court for today. Like I said, it's just a pretrial. If he knew what was good for him, he would hire an attorney. Now, that being said, we will be keeping a close eye on this trial and we will be updating you as there are new updates. But for now, I also have another hilarious video for you to watch. And it's actually Ray Go Monkey going to City Hall to speak. Now, usually he tries to make some sense, but this time he didn't even put in any effort to make any sense whatsoever. They're going to hear about me, Mafia Dave County. How you doing, everybody? Hello, county commissioners. How many how many minutes do I have? Two minutes to be started. I, I, I got, no, no, they haven't started yet. They haven't started yet. Don't, no, hey, don't start the clock. I haven't started yet. Yo, my, I, I need to reset my time. I haven't started yet. Two minutes and they started. I, I got, no, 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 they haven't started yet. They haven't started yet. Start the clock. Don't, no, hey, don't start the clock. I haven't started yet. Yo, my, I, I need to reset my time. I haven't started yet. So, what's the agenda item on? What, what do I have to speak about? So, they're supposed to wait for him and allow him more time 
because he hasn't clicked the record button on his GoPro. They're supposed to wait for him to record because the entitled YouTuber wants more time. Complete nonsense. And wait till you hear the things he's about to say. Now, let me get this straight. I know he's totally allowed to talk. This is exactly where you should be redressing your grievances. But listen to the nonsense that's going to come out of his mouth. Or can I speak on anything? What's the agenda item? Up for 5A. What's the, what is 5A? It's, it's public comment, not public question and answer. Okay, so I can say whatever I want? On 5A. On 5A. Well, let me say something about 5A. You people name? need to vote against 5A. your name on your address. Rafael. Why, why, why? When you people know who I am. But don't I come here every time and give my name and my address? That Rafael Antonio Gomez, 7403 Southwest 82nd Street, Miami. Quit playing with me. Mafia Day County Commissioners. Listen, I don't know what the agenda item is, but if it's like anything we know, it's a waste of money because that's all you people do. So we should vote no on it. We can't trust you people. We can't trust Republicans. We can't trust Democrats. I, I don't know what it is. Just don't vote on it. It would be better if you people went to the beach and had a pina colada and did nothing. This lady right here, that's why I have my camera pointed because- You, you will actually not direct comments directly to any individual Okay, 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 that's fine, that's fine. But I come here and, and the commissioners don't pay attention. They walk out, they leave. So I gotta put my camera at you people so I have evidence of you people not paying attention to me. I don't know what the agenda item is, but we're not gonna vote on it. I'm telling y'all not to vote on it. It's bad, everything you people do is bad. And now we're gonna have a moment of silence. So with my last seconds, I want to say long live Trump, long live Putin, long live DeSantis, and all you people should be thrown in jail. All of you. You're all crooked. Mafia Day County. Nobody trusts you people. Nobody trusts Republicans and Democrats. Thank you. Laura Reynolds on 5A. <laughs> You can't do worse. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you just can't do worse. I mean, I would want to speak after that every time. Whatever you say, the answer is yes. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Please, name and address. Laura Reynolds, 6820 Southwest 64th Court. Um, I disagree with our previous speaker. I do think you should support this item. <laughs> Um, and Happy New Year. I never think it's too late to say Happy New Year, and I'm looking forward to working off on, with you on a number of land use issues this year, and this item will make it much easier. So there you have it. Rego Monkey, once again, is the butt of the joke. Everywhere he goes, nobody takes him seriously because he's a clown. Anyways, that's it for today. Thanks for watching, everybody. Please like and subscribe. It really helps the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next video. If you want to watch more fraud editors getting owned, just head on over to our second channel. The link will be in the description. I live here!